uh, I used to do two, two kinds of jobs. One was to be an art director on a daily basis. It means producing a newspaper, planning it, working with editors, and then designing uh, the pages. And my other job, which I like actually more, is to be a consultant and strategist and to design the whole idea, the whole concept of the newspaper, to redesign them, to start new projects in different countries, different places. So I'm basically responsible for uh, discussing about the strategy of the publication, uh, the readers, the market, what kind of product we should deliver them. Then I'm talking with editors about the content sections, what kind of pages, and then I'm designing the, the general design of the of the newspaper, the mock-up of the newspaper. Okay, so the trend is quite clear now that the newspaper should be more magazine style. So basically your presentation is a little bit old school now and you really have to try harder now to, to make it much more appealing, much more dynamic. Uh, you have to deal with uh, presentation using um, infographics using uh, boxes, pullouts and all these editorial and design tools that we use to sell the story. I don't see much of these uh, tools in your, in your newspapers. And also I think uh, you need to work on uh, finding some visual leaders in your publications. It looks like you don't have strong uh, personalities some designers are directors that are actually leaders in the publications and are on the same or similar level as the editor-in-chief to create the, the, the product. Yeah, they should study this. They, they don't have to actually study it in the university. They, they can learn it themselves because this knowledge is, is quite new and it's changing constantly. So the new things are coming up every, every few months, every year. So I think the, especially editors should really invest in, uh, in the education and, and try to look for news about design, how to make an appealing presentation, how to sell the story, what are the new type of tools, editorial design tools that you should use to, to sell the story. They also should think about the perception of the reader because it's changing very fast. And the things we used to do like this traditional headline text and maybe photo is, 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 is a 19th century model for a newspaper. And when you look at the magazines, even if you just go to a kiosk and buy some American magazines like GQ or Fast Company uh, or Monocle, you can see how they deal with the presentation, what kind of tools they use. And it's really a very easy way to inspire yourself and make a much better product.